Oh, hi there, Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Home Center, Exotic Gardening, and SherryAnnRichardson.com. Oh, lovely. Um, <laughs> we have a nasty winter storm that has rolled in. Um, we have already gotten uh, a couple of inches worth of snow uh, overnight. Um, it hadn't started snowing when I went to bed about 9 between 9 and 10 last night um, but they were already talking you know road cl school closures delays all sorts of things yesterday uh, for this morning um, and you know I was trying to figure it out last night you know because it hadn't even started snowing yet um, but I got up this morning there were a couple inches of snow um, I uh, came through town rather than taking county roads um, the roads weren't too bad um, the plows were starting to work but they you know uh, there was there was still some accumulation um, they weren't you know perfectly clear uh, got to work they uh, they announced earlier today that uh, we are on a delay tomorrow um, basically a, most of us are on a, a two hour delay um, so I come in two hours later uh, means I'll be here two hours later as well um, so it'll be late tomorrow evening before I'm actually out of here but uh, they're trying to give people a, a chance you know that have the road crews out overnight clearing the roads and hopefully you know by the time people are coming in at like seven o'clock tomorrow morning um, the roads will be in better condition um, because we're expected to get I've heard between eight and twelve inches um, and like I said we got a couple of inches overnight um, you know with what with the snow that we already had on the ground um, you know, so there are some areas that are, are deeper than others, um, but the uh, the parking lot here, I mean, it was it was basically completely clear yesterday um, of snow um, between the the plows and the fact that the sun was out shining yesterday and, and melted um, some of the snow. Because I was when I was wandering around outside yesterday, it actually felt kind of nice, and uh, I was trudging through some mud in spots where the sun had melted the snow and thawed the ground underneath enough that it was muddy. So, but today, I mean, it's frozen over uh, again, um, you know, and there is uh, some fairly decent snow on the ground there's probably a couple of inches at this point um, and it's just supposed to keep snowing and blowing all night long because that's the other part of this right now uh, I just checked the, the, the weather and it was like 13 degrees but the wind chill puts it at minus 10 so and that's that's the biggest problem right now we have some pretty good wind going with this and so uh, it's blowing and drifting the snow and making the uh, air temperature very cold. So it's gonna be, you know, it's gonna be lovely by tomorrow morning. Um, I get to have fun tonight. Um, Sherry messaged me just a little bit ago that the wood rack that I had uh, filled up yesterday um, is empty now so I'm going to have to spend some of my time out in this nastiness trying to find and split some wood so that we at least have some wood through the night um, I don't know that we're gonna have any wood for tomorrow at this point so I wasn't expecting her to burn through all of what I had um, you know I figured there would be you know a decent amount because I brought wood in this morning and I thought, you know, I had about half a wood rack or so, maybe a third of a wood rack, 
left, and I figured that would, you know, I was hoping to get at least a couple of days out of the, uh, the wood that I took care of yesterday. Obviously, I was wrong. Either it's burning very fast, or um, it's just, you know, she's burning too much of it. <laughs> so, oh, but yeah, this is this is lovely Indiana weather. Um, of course, it's not just Indiana with this weather. Um, I know, you know, like half the country right now is dealing with this stuff. It's it's stretched. Um, I was just talking to my supervisor. She has friends in Louisiana, and there are people dealing with snow down there in New Orleans, um, which is very unusual for them to get snow. Um, I've seen posts from friends out in Texas uh, who have who are dealing with snow, um, and the storm is stretching all the way up, you know, to the Canadian border. Um, so, you know, it's, it's all the way across the country, basically, uh, from north to south, and uh, moving from west to east. So, it's dumping a lot of snow a lot of places, a lot of places that don't normally get it. So, but anyways, I think that's going to do it for today. Um, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below, and uh, we will see everybody tomorrow. Stay safe out there. Stay inside if you don't have to go out.